There's something about having that one-on-one -on -one time with the sun. You feel moved by it. You can go in and attempt to teach a bunch of people high-level solar physics or why they should care about science in general, but Solarium, in its simplicity and its construction, I think does something greater than in form, it inspires. People walk away wanting to know more about what they just experienced. There's some nice loops happening right in there also. Uh -huh, there's like a little bit of sparkling. Solarium is a large-scale digital art installation and it uses footage from NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory to create an immersive experience for the viewer. So when you're viewing Solarium, you're seeing all kinds of really amazing solar events, like solar flares and prominence eruptions. You get to see active regions doing their work and churning and creating loops and sparks. All of these top four and image on the bottom right are all images from the Solar Dynamics Observatory, which is the spacecraft that provides the data and imagery for the Solarium exhibit. The images that you see in the Solarium exhibit are part of a set of cameras that allow us to look at the sun in 10 different wavelengths of light, from the visible all the way through ultraviolet and extreme ultraviolet. A lot of the really interesting stuff that happens on the sun, like solar flares and coronal mass ejections, is really visible in these wavelengths of light that don't make it to the ground. We get a stream of information of zeros and ones that come down, and then once we get that, we have to decode it and turn it back into an image. We'll take all of this information to our data visualizer and he'll take all of the data that SDO has sent down. He'll find the parameters and he'll code all of that data into images for us. And he'll produce thousands and thousands of frames. And each one of these frames is actually quite large. It's bigger than 4K for a TV. It's about big enough to fill nine HD televisions. It's pretty hefty material. When people enter Solarium, we want people to be able to experience the really wonderful, awe-inspiring, yet soothing sense of calm you get when you're viewing this material in this way. I'm hoping that people will come and feel the passion, feel the excitement, feel the amazement, and simply want to know more about science and want it to be a part of their life not to necessarily understand all of the minutia and, the, and, and sort of the gory details, you know, but to enjoy it and to look at images from SDO or anything and just be happy and excited about that.